Cloudy McDoom. Like, comment, and subscribe. Let's go. Two years later and this park feels the exact same. Sometimes it's hard to believe that 2020 even happened. It actually feels kind of weird not holding a camera rig too. Back then, my camera was like an extension of me or something like that. I'll actually be surprised if anyone even recognizes me for the old Akio Boy cosplay videos. I mean, it has been a couple of years, so. Come to think about it, I remember filming a bunch of Naruto cosplayers out in that field. Yeah, that's right. I used the Bruno Mars remix for that year's cosplay music video. 2018 feels even further away now. One of these days I should ride that Ferris wheel. Atlanta itself probably has tons of cool attractions beyond conventions, to be honest. I mean, this fountain looks pretty interesting. Sometimes, I get the insatiable urge to jump into fountains with my clothes still on. And I'm not even sure why. Eh, people might think I'm trying to steal coins from the water or something stupid like that. Plus, I hate wearing soggy clothes anyway. No, I remember this hotel. I shared a room with a cluster of cosplayers my first time here in 2015. <laughs> never again. Regardless, it was a really good time. And I met some pretty cool people back then. Now I can't help but wonder, Maybe there's another aspiring videographer spending their weekend up there right now. Full circle and all that. Wow. Even now, I can still see myself running through this courtyard with my camera. Feels like I never left this place. The lighting in this area was always the best. That's some pretty cool artwork. One thing I've noticed about conventions is no matter how much time passes, they always feel the same, like a fantasy high school or something. Actually, some cosplayers still gossip like they're in high school, so that's kind of funny. Oh, whoops. Masks are obligatory beyond this point. To get downstairs into the convention, at least. And they are definitely cracking down on people.
Ah, here we go. <laughs> Nothing brings back convention memories like crowded escalators. Let's speed this up a bit. Hmm. This year they spread everything out across multiple levels. Makes perfect sense for social distancing purposes. And plus, you never know. Momokan just might grow to be the size of Dragon Con one day. I'll probably know that I've truly made it when a convention of this size invites me as a guest. All right, vendor hall. That's a pretty cool female Thor. It's the final day of the convention, so I guess everyone's doing their last minute shopping. Man, if Panadonia and her girls got her cup of Kawhi brand in here, they make a killing. Note to self. Help Panadonia get her cup of Kawhi brand in other vendor halls. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, I think I'm done here. Plus, I'm broke anyway. I think I'm ready to sign out for the day. But it was nice coming back here. All the memories. And the good times. Two years later in this courtyard, it feels the exact same. Oh, thank God you heard a few years back. Yeah. All right. One, two. Got it. Yeah, that's right. 